Will Beyonce follow his advice? Many Beyonce fans have a bone to pick with the country music community, specifically with the lack of prizes and nominations at events like People's Choice Country Awards and the Country Music Award this year. Moreover, they believe that she's not getting the respect she deserves only because of her usual association to other genres, as well as claims of racism. After all, Cowboy Carter has proven to be culturally, critically, and commercially successful. However, country artists have their own perspective. During an appearance on Andy Cohen's podcast, star Luke Bryan theorized as to why this disconnect might exist and what the Houston superstar could do to change that. It's a tricky question because, obviously, Beyoncé made a country album and Beyoncé has a lot of fans out there that have her back, Luke Bryan suggested. And if she doesn't get something they want, man, they come at you, as fans should do. I'm all for everybody coming in and making country albums and all that. A lot of great music is overlooked. Just because she made one, just cause I make one, I don't get any nominations. Everybody loved that Beyonce made a country album. Nobody's mad about it, Luke Bryan continued. But where things get a little tricky if you're gonna make country albums come into our world and be country with us a little bit. Like, Beyonce can do exactly what she wants to. She's probably the biggest star in music. But come to an award show and high five us and have fun and get in the family too. And I'm not saying she didn't do that, but country music is a lot about family. Ironically enough, Luke Bryan will host the Country Music Awards this year, his fourth appearance as the ceremony's guide. Of course, Beyonce could continue to make country music as she sees fit and with whoever she wants, while showing off her love of Levi's jeans. Yet the way that Bryan speaks on the matter could parallel how other communities feel about artists that are not like them engaging in their craft. There's also a long and complicated history about the exploitation of black genres and art forms that is too important for this sole article to cover. But it's a worthy question to ask.